I am nowhere near done with catching up with Red Velvet music. But now they're having a comeback at the end of this month. I'm screwed. <laughs> Hey guys, I hope you're having a fantastic day today, whether it's morning, evening or night time for you. Today we are finally finishing off um, the Feel My Rhythm album, mini album, whatever. Um, I'm especially doing this because now there's a new album coming out and also I miss Red Velvet man. I haven't reacted or listened to anything Red Velvet now since I did the Soul Gate and I really naughty video, that's the last Red Velvet related thing I've done and I think that was like two weeks ago or something, I don't know. Feels like it's been a long time so I definitely have been missing my Red Velvet content. Um, I'm very excited for this comeback. I have no clue, a lot of people are saying it's gonna, it looks like it's gonna be the Velvet side so like... <sighs> Oh, we're worrying for something if that's the case. But without further ado, let's get into this reaction. Okay, the first song we have is Bambolia. I have no idea what to expect. I have been, I have done a lot of videos today so I've been like getting attacked from like different groups so like I just feel personally attacked by them right now as well. Oh, oh sulky voice, it's like butter. Just all their voices together, the harmonization is just it's so good. <sighs> it's, it's very late, I'm very delusional, so I do apologize. I'm just like. I feel like I'm such an idiot because I don't know what Bambolia means. <laughs> like I should probably know what that word means, but I don't. harmonies and like just it's oh uh, my brain like what why why wendy what was the need for these ad lips <laughs> First of all, <clears throat> we're going all the way back to Joy's ad lib. And then, Wendy. That's all. Oh. 
I don't want it, Wendy. I don't want to. Like, this is so high pitched. It's been, it's been like so long since I've like consumed red velvet content that like I don't know what to do. Okay next we have good bad and ugly and I don't know if this is gonna be like a in your face type song or like I don't, I don't know. I just don't know anymore. Why are we always start with soggy man? Come on. flirting with me already hold on we're only like 20 seconds in you can't be flirting with me like that you, you're so beautiful you're beautiful wendy you are Sometimes good, sometimes bad, and ugly, bro. I love me. Come on, bro. I mean, honestly, Red Velvet have never been ugly. Like, they just haven't. But, you know, like, they just, they, they kill it all the time. <laughs> This beat as well. Secretly, uh, it erases like the snow melting. Yeah. Exactly, it cannot be avoided. Why not just enjoy every bit of it? Now I could be interpreting the song completely wrong, but considering we're on the theme of like loving myself, even for the good, the bad, and the ugly, you know, why am I not enjoying every bit of it? Well, I can, you know, for Red Velvet or just any K-pop group in general, the online hate they may receive, not may, they do receive on a daily basis can be so overwhelming and it's probably really hard to like look past it i mean even like you know obviously i've had no near as bad as they do but i've had a few rude people in my comments sometimes that like say that like i talk too much or like i don't i'm overreacting or you know i put i like i'm doing the most when i need to chill it's not that serious you know type thing and like you know it's stuff like that where it's like you just need to ignore it because it's at the end of the day that's just someone wasting the time i'm getting sidetracked it but like i love the message behind the song a lot i love wendy and sophie's voice together i love all of their voices together the most though Attracted, 
Oh, that was so good. That was so good. That was such a good message in the song. Even if I didn't get the message quite right, that was still such a beautiful song just then. Already we're at the last song and I'm so sad because I love this album. I mean, again, I have it up there. I did do an unboxing of it, but I lost the footage. It'd be like that. But we have In My Dreams. Let's get into it. tell but like I'm using a speaker now for audio to make it better I don't know if it's actually working this these videos are actually kind of the test but this bass is going so hard that my desk is shaking <laughs> This is very like Disney princess vibes and I'm in love. I absolutely love this. Like come in with these really hard choruses and then they go back into the flow. And it's like hard chorus, the flow, it's just it's I just like I like got lost in it then but that like part where it was like Wendy and then Irene and then was it Joy? I love that. And the other laugh too are uh, beautiful. Get the Irene. I'm gonna really struggle to have a favourite in this album, like really struggle. No, Wendy. No, I didn't go back enough then.
No, don't tell me we're done. Don't tell me we're over, please. I think it's safe to say that in my dreams tonight you see what I did there in my dreams tonight will just be sweet heavenly red velvet vocals I will just be sleeping and just being blessed by the true angels that are red velvet I am very excited for this new comeback nothing else has been announced except for like it's happening I'm pretty sure unless something else has been released that I don't know then you guys can put me in on that but yeah we are officially done with our first ever Red Velvet album, mini album, EP, whatever you want to call it. We've finally completed one. We have like 20 million more to go and now a new one on the way so I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. As always I hope you guys are excited for the new comeback and I will see you guys soon for the next reaction video.